Hello, I'm Orlando Taylor. I'm an advisor to the president of Fielding Graduate University in California. And I'm a PI, or principal investigator of a major project funded by the National Science Foundation to understand the leadership styles and strategies that are employed at the nation's historically black colleges and universities to prepare individuals to enter the STEM fields. Now you may wonder why we focus on the historically black colleges and universities. And the reason that we do that is that these institutions, believe it or not, are national leaders of producing men and women who pursue successfully degrees in STEM at the undergraduate level, and they go on to get graduate degrees in those same fields. And the exciting thing about that is that these institutions often do not have world-class laboratories or great endowments or large budgets, uh, don't have Nobel laureates. Usually the things you expect that institutions would have if they're gonna be great producers of individuals who enter the science fields, but they do not, yet they are national leaders per capita in producing graduates who go on to get degrees and later get doctoral degrees in STEM. So we're trying in the STEM, in the Castle Project, the Center for the Advancement of STEM Leadership, to understand the leadership behaviors in these institutions that lead to those results. We think leadership is a very important reason as to why these institutions are successful. The project was done in collaboration with other institutions, namely the University of the Virgin Islands, North Carolina University, uh, a and University, Agricultural and Technical University, the Association of American Colleges and Universities, and of course, I'm proud to say, Fielding Graduate University. It's a major project. It's funded at the level of $9 million to identify these traits and to and to prepare a new generation based on that research through professional development to take up the, the task uh, of producing a new generation of individuals who enter these fields successfully. So thank you for listening.